But here's our new spacer system. This is a 360 case and a 720 case. Right now the 360 is loaded with two grains and the 460 is loaded with four. Normally it has six. And these are the new forward closure. As you can see there's a threaded boss for a eye bolt or something similar. I'll take one of these apart and you kind of can see what we've got going here. Our normal closure, same thread length, same thread. You're looking in now, you see a spacer, which I'll pull out. There's the spacer. And then we have a forward closure, which I'll take out. This is the forward spacer with our standard RMS Plus delay system. And if you look in the top of the motor, it's a standard look. It's the, uh, the wafer kind with the forward uh, fiber wafer and the O-ring that's normally used. And as you can see, this is the delay end, typical delay well with the powder and the paper cap retaining it. And then it's just merely, reload is nearly, is merely built just like uh, normal. Same parts, O-rings placed in, the closures placed, the spacers placed in, and then threaded on here. And there you have it. Five, four, three, two, one, ignition. Five, four, three, two, one, ignition. We're done firing now. So now we'll take the motors apart, take a look at them. Now this is the uh, 360 motor in which we put two grains in and one spacer. Spacer coming out. Not really too dirty. And the closure. And like we said, that the uh, reload is essentially same parts as you would use in the standard configuration.